What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. This time it's going to be a little bit more about me and not Fleming, but that's okay. Um, so, exciting news. I have officially started my first contest prep, like bodybuilding show. Uh, I'm in, uh, I'm in to like two weeks, two weeks I think I've been doing it, yeah. So, it's pretty interesting, it's completely different than what I'm used to. I'm used to, you know, eating and then once I get to a certain point, then getting more food and eating. And now it's like, I'm hungry, and then they cut more food, and then I'm hungrier, and then they cut more food. So, it's going to be a challenge, but... I'm here for it. I'm excited. I've been working with Ivana for like about a year. Oh my goodness, like a year. And like literally as my body weight has probably changed like maybe two pounds, but like how I look now compared to how I looked last May is a completely different person. Like my body has changed so, so, so much. It's believable. Like it's crazy how somebody's body can go from what you think looks good and then when you really put in the hard work and the food and you train differently like your body can change like it's crazy like the amount of effort I've put in and the amount of days I have not wanted to work out this is ridiculous but we made it through we pushed through we like the changes we've seen and everything so so, I tried making this video like a week ago, and it, I just don't like it, so I had to start over. But, so on Memorial Day, I had my consultation with my bikini company that I chose to go with. I went with one that wasn't quite, I mean, it's known, it's known, but like, I didn't go with like Angel Bikinis, which everyone wanted me to go with, because I just felt like their prices were a little bit more pricey and I didn't like their suits as much as the brand I got so the next thing I want to talk about with you guys is honestly the hardest part about prep so far is like remembering you're on prep right so let me set this up here there we go. so like remembering you're on prep so you can't eat the pita chips and the hummus, or you can't eat eat cookies. Like you can't eat cookies. You can't. So, I mean, the hard part is just remembering that. Like at work when I'm hungry, we have those Nature Valley peanut bars, the peanut butter ones. Those that work for the employees, and you know sometimes they just call my name, and I can't have it. I just instead of eating it, I drink my water. So. The hardest part is just changing your habits of thinking, you know, like, I can't have this. I can't do this right now, you know. But, like, eating, eating the same food isn't hard for me. It really isn't because you, you can change it up so easily. You can change your veggies. You can change your sauces. You can change the way you eat your potatoes. You can make it mashed. You can make it chopped. You can dice it, you can do all sorts of stuff that helps you change it so it doesn't feel like you're eating the same food all the time. So that, the hardest part is just remembering and saying no to the stuff you used to be able to eat. Now off season, you can eat whatever you want. I mean, you want to still have like an 80-20 balanced life, you know, where you can eat your healthy food, but you can go out and you can have tacos or you can go out and have ice cream. Like, I made sure before I started prep that we were going out. We had sushi. We had lots of ice cream and cookies. And we got European cookies. And I had a bubba tea. And we just enjoyed life. We went out to breakfast. We had a nice breakfast together. We, but Yeah. So, I'll try to get into workout videos in here for you guys. So, you guys can see what I'm working now. Maybe I'll show you some of my food. I'm not sure. Let me know what you guys want to see during my prep because I want to document as much as possible. And then I think I'm going to do like every two weeks a video, different topics to talk about and like what workouts you want to see. 
um, yeah, I'm excited to sh do a show. I All right, new location. About to go hit legs with Ivana. We're gonna record. I just went through some posing with her. We got my routine down again, a new one. But here we go. Let's hit it like they. Okay, so we just got done with our workout. I don't think I got everything recorded, but you know, it is what it is. It was a brutal leg day. Like, uh, we were still sore because we've hit legs three days in the past five days. So it was a little rough, but we did it anyways. All right, well, here's a tip I just did leg day. I still have cereal in my diet on high days, you know. I'm a snacker, right? So the best way to eat this cereal is one piece, by one. Bro, who does that? <laughs> Just eat your and, damn food. And then, when, and then when you get down a little bit, because it definitely does, we can't put milk in here. There's nothing in the bowl. So once you get down to a nice level, then you add your milk. You can definitely put milk in here. What are you talking about? 
But then the bottom ones are the only soggy ones. That's the best part. So either way, you're eating crunchy cereal. Whatever, dude. I like to snack on them like this. And of all cereals, <laughs> she picks this. She picks this. You don't pick that. <laughs> if you're me, you pick a real cereal. Like this. Yeah, but those get soggy if you don't eat them fast enough. Well, you don't. You don't have to eat them. Or. Those are good. Yeah. Those are real good. Some of these. Not sex mix. I'm happy with my choice. Alright, how am I doing on prep? You're actually doing way better than me. You actually have me motivated to do another prep myself. But yeah, Tara's been super, you know, diligent. She's been super on track. I'm proud of her. I didn't expect her to do this well. <laughs> Thanks, babe. Thanks. You're doing great. All right, I will catch you guys in the next two weeks. Bye.